So, we have some really big news today. According to the Casting Collective website, the Batman film is currently looking for fire dancers, fire breathers, puppet operators, and most importantly, circus skills. Now, this is huge for anybody in the Bat fandom, because anybody that knows the Batman mythos even a little bit will know that there is only one character that has significant ties to the circus, and that character, of course, is Dick Grayson, the first Robin. Now, there were rumors a while ago that Timothy Chalamet was being eyed to play Dick Grayson, although nothing concrete actually ever came of this. Now, while he doesn't exactly look like the role of Dick Grayson, I think he would be a fantastic choice for the character. He was in the recent Little Women movie, whose costume designer is actually working on the Batman film. He really admires the character of Robin, even going as far to say that he would introduce himself as Robin when he was a little kid. And with somebody who loves and respects the source material as much as he does, I think he would do a fantastic job. And he's also worked with Robert Pattinson before. Now, we probably won't see Robin in all of his comic book glory immediately in the Batman film. It'll most likely be more of a cameo or tease for an upcoming film. But the biggest part about this is most of the live action movies have steered away from Robin considering the failures of Batman Forever and of course Batman and Robin, neither of which were the fault of the character of Robin himself, simply the bad writing of Joel Schumacher. Now the Robins, specifically Tim Drake the third Robin, are some of my favorite characters in all of fiction. In fact, Tim Drake might be my very favorite character in all fiction. So if they really are planning to build up a Bat family centered movie franchise, it would literally be a dream come true for me. And many other other Bat fans. And considering how many characters are in this film, of course Carmine Falcone, the Riddler, Penguin, Catwoman, Lieutenant Gordon, which could eventually lead to the introduction of Barbara Gordon, aka the first Batgirl, it seems like this movie is really building on something. I mean, there's really not any other reason for them to have so many characters in the film. And back in 2016, we actually got a test video from Ryan Potter, who is famous for playing Hero in Big Hero 6, and of course Beast Boy in the Titans TV show, stating the iconic line from Tim Drake, Hey Ben. Like Tim said, Batman needs a Robin. And while this probably won't happen, especially since they have to introduce Dick Grayson and Jason Todd before they get to Tim Drake, I still think Ryan Potter would make a great Dick Grayson. But what do you guys think? Let me know what you think in the comments section below. This has been Bovine Designs, and I'll catch you guys next time for more comic book news, animations, and reviews. Y'all have a good one.